lots, of course, going on in the Epic world. Um, the Epic M cameras, the first cameras that we built, have been going out in a, in a very, uh, pretty wide distribution to a lot of very, very big movies and many projects all around the world. This is an Epic camera. You may see something that's a little different, a little interesting for a cinema camera. This particular camera has a, a Canon uh, automation uh, mounting, as opposed to a more traditional PL mount. So this has the ingenue zoom on it. Same camera, but different configurations, different use case, right? Because this camera is becoming very popular for both stills and motion. So we now have the ability to support Canon lenses and, and read out the electronics in the lens. So this lens actually has autofocus. So if I depress the, the button halfway, I get autofocus. And everything is controlled by the touch screen, of course. Make this brighter so you can see. OK, so you see it? So it grabs focus there. And there's ways to actually track focus on the screen, set up rack focus on the screen. And of course, it's small, it's lightweight. It's basically the same sort of form factor as your small HD camera. But of course, this is a 5K high resolution motion picture camera. So the Scarlet update is kind of interesting. Um, because of the situation that happened in Japan, the very unfortunate situation there with the earthquake, uh, and the Scarlet had an integrated lens system that, um, that became more delayed. So we've made sort of a, a different strategy in our company now to not talk so much about things that are um, a little bit out, because it's been delayed a little bit. The next time you'll hear me actually talk about Scarlet is when we have something to ship, as opposed to me telling you about how great Scarlet is and then not shipping it. Um, we think that's a better strategy. And the world is quite complex. This thing is, of course, where our focus is right now. Scarlet is still, of course, on the board and, and in development and working, reworking a lot of the things that were problematic, uh, things we couldn't get built right away. So it'll come, uh, but it'll come and I'll tell you when we're ready to ship it.